G'day and welcome to Vino Mofo TV. My name is Lee, this is Andre and Justin. Today, boys, I brought you here because I was reading an article the other day on hyper decanting. Hyper decanting. So, hyper decanting. Uh, yes. Is, I've heard uh, of this. Yeah. And that's why I see a blender. So, I've got a blender here. Um, so, what it is, is in America, it's taken off that. People are decanting their wines with a blender. With a blender. So, Have you tried it? And I haven't, and that's why. Oh, yeah, that's why I no, thought I let's let's bring all methods of decanting out today, give them a crack, and see what works and, and what doesn't. So why do you decant a wine? Um, well, usually very young, very old to breathe. Breathe. Decant it so it breathes and to filter out sediment, right? Yeah. Why does right. it need to breathe? Well, breathe opens it up, right? and yeah. then to, obviously to get rid of the sediment in an older wine, you don't want to drink the sediment, it just tastes awful. So this is the breathing, so this is the idea, and, look, and, a, and a, a wine's been in a bottle, and out it comes, it's exposed to air, and it starts to breathe. Decanting just, just does it anyway, decanting speeds up the breathing process by exposing it to more air, Beautiful. both through the pouring of it and the surface area, right? Yes. Correct. Which is interesting for the blender, and that... It's like churning it up. Yeah, it's really throwing it around. Bubbles. You know, I, I want to know. <laughs> Does the blender damage it? You know when they... Have you ever heard of pressed juices compared to blending juices? Like, I have. This yeah. is like kind of all new trendy, whatever. So um, it's soft. It's like this, like this pressing. So they're not heating up the like molecules or whatever it is in the juice, which apparently damages, changes, whatever. So I wonder what a... a Blender does to a wine. So what's this? So we've got a Kaiser Mataro 2010, uh, which is a belter of a wine, um, and, it, and it's massive, young. I thought it's probably a perfect designed to be yeah. needs some time, right? Yeah. So I thought let's try it just as normal first. Yeah. yeah. And then we'll take it through the steps. Right. Good idea. It's a perfect wine for this. It's tight and big, which is perfect. Yeah, it's all zip. I mean, it's massive, but. I think the most common misconception, everything, everything, everything I see out there, is that people think older wines need longer to decant. It's kind of the opposite. If a wine is made to be aged and you're drinking it young, then it needs more time. If you've got a Grange or something like that and you're drinking it when it's released and really it should be drunk 10 years time, it might need a day to yeah. open out. Or a three hours. If you've got a really old wine, sometimes it only needs... Half an hour, and will age so rapidly when it starts to breathe, and that will deteriorate. So it's the opposite. So time in a young wine that needs aging is more important. That's why it can. Yes. So I thought yes. let, let's wine. let's start with traditional way of decanting first. You see it. So we've got a decanter. Yep. But for today, I'm going to ditch it. Yes, good. I'm going to show you that it's exactly the same in a water jug. No, 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 yeah, okay. So I'll get, I'll get rid of You're going to add wine to the water. No, no, no. Let's get rid of the water first. No, yeah, because this is. We, just... We've tested this time on time and time again, and trust me, it works. It's it works. identical. If you don't want to spend 200 bucks on Montana, get a $3 fucking water jug and stick it in there. I've done it in like a plastic bowl when on like holidays in a holiday house. Stick it in. Or camping, you know what I mean? Yeah, same. It's just anything with more surface area than a bottle and the vigorous pouring is what you Vigorous pour, pouring, it? yeah. All right. Swirl it around. Swirl it around. Swirl it around. Are we gonna put one in? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I reckon we'll compare them. All right. All right so this is. All right. So let's get this. The decanter slash jug slash arm decant. Arm decant. Bang. Mm -hmm. Next one. Next one is Venturi. People <sighs> often want to know if do these work, and this is probably one of the most asked questions I get yeah. about wine: is do these fucking things work? Drive me mad. I got no idea. So let's find out. So, so again, cellar doors use these. Exactly, so look at the bubbles coming out of there. Can you see that? That's all it's doing is injecting air bubbles into this, shredding it. So the principle makes sense. The principle right? makes it's kind sense. of like a mini blender. Yeah. You know when you do your aggressive Barossa pour, you go do, 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 yeah. do, to get the most air bubbles chugging up through the bottle. This is what you go for. So that's what that's doing. All right. All right. Uh, blender off. Third one. Boom. I've been hanging Boom. out. I've been hanging out all week for this. Can you get the, uh, the lid firmly down on that? Uh, <laughs> now, boys, blend it today. <laughs> All right. Who knows what's gonna happen? Yeah, lids on. Andre, can he work it? All right, you ready? Hold the lid. All right. And we have power knot. All right. Are we? Best episode ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'll make the noise. You shake it. <laughs> 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 Uh, technical assistance. 
Where'd you buy this fucking blender from? This is... Have you tried this before? No! Is that, does that actually have power in it? Do, do we know that it has power? Yeah. That We'll be right back. <laughs> We're going to find a way to turn this blender on. We'll be right back with you. Alright. Well, awesome. boys, <laughs> if you just turn it the other way, it, uh, it works. Worked, you've worked it out. So, let's, let's give it a blend. Oh! It's like a wine that, milkshake. That doesn't look like it's very good for the wine. Is that all you meant to do? Just like a little... That's it, yeah, I, had a, I YouTubed it. I, that stinks. So... <laughs> That's new, isn't it? Yeah, it's brand new. Now we have a sparkling red. I've just got to work it out again. <laughs> <laughs> Best episode ever. All right, we're on. Best year. We're on. Give me some of that shake. All right. Oh, thank you. Look, it's aerated. Now yeah, it's settled. Aerated. That, oh, that's the aim, isn't it? I mean, yeah. you want it to breathe. Fuck, it's, uh, it's been in a Michael Jackson oxygen tank. All right, All right boys. This so is, uh, let's, let's start right, right to left. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so first one being a jug. A jug. Jug slash decanter. Do you remember Should what it was like? Un yeah. yeah, it's definitely more open for sure. Oh, it's still tight though. That was a gentle method. It just takes a bit of time. You want to open that out for three, four hours. Yeah, exactly. So that's a little bit more open, but it's still quite tight. Still quite tight. All right, All right. the Venturi. Venturi. Right. Right. A lot of my friends swear by as well. Yeah, same. A bit more chocolate sort yeah, of coming through on it. It's got some more kind of like herbally lifted kind of things going on. Yeah, that's what yeah. I got. Alright, let's get this out of screenshot. My trusty blender. Do you know what? It's got more length. It's actually got a richer palette as well. And lots more length. Like a really... Gee, I stand corrected because I hate those things. Wow, yeah, that definitely works. It's yeah, changed. Yeah. it's changed. It's like, oh, that's completely different wine. Three times the wine yeah. in length to me, mm. and, and and like volume and. Oh, right, boys! Right. Blender. Blender. <laughs> it's pretty cool if this works. I don't know whether that's the plastic in the blender, but it's got some weird shit going on. <laughs> it's oily. It and it's it's extracted. Is that yeah. just my imagination? I think it tastes fat and oily. Yeah. So I don't know if it's just super opened out or there's something in that blender. So to me, it tastes extracted. No, I, I, Does it? Yeah, yeah, like really tannic extracted. See, I, I put boiling water through that blender, so I got rid of all that all right. shit. But uh, to me... It, I think them to, to be honest that middle one shits over all of them it does and I hate to say it. Do you know I hate to say it because I hate that fucking thing and I hate that in, I'm going to show you something something a mate of mine Jock Harley in uh, Cranville he's got massive hands and he's made I've seen my girly hands I, 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 he just goes right give it a good shake put your hand over it give it a good shake and then um, and then that similar process I wonder if that uh, if you got clean hands <laughs> I've, I've, a lot right. of winemakers do do that. Yeah, yeah. Out in yeah. the tank, out in the barrel. You look cool when you do that, Ricky. You look like you. Yeah, so you're cool. Nah, so cool, man. You're, 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 you're the farmyard yeah, guy yeah, yeah. out the back. Just... But, um, I got, yeah, I really I'm, am disappointed to say that that really worked. The Venturi, beautiful. Okay, we've got to get some sponsorship going with those guys. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's almost like it was better, best, and then it started going past it. Yeah, I think that's I, I, I think it just smashed it, and I don't know. How, I you know I don't know how hot that blade gets or yeah, you exactly. know. Yeah, exactly. It's really almost like it has heated it. Yeah, yeah. It's oh, yeah. Like, there's something weird about it. But anyway, but a golden rule: normal young wine that you want it three to four hours is a good guideline. Older wine or a cheap wine or a just your ready to drink wine. Half an hour, 15 minutes, every wine benefits from half an hour. Seriously, yeah. and use a water jug. Like, yeah. don't be scared of using a water jug. I love it. I love I've it. used so many different utensils yeah. in my kitchen for I've decanting used a, water. I've, yeah, used, yeah, a, I've yeah. used a metal bowl, I've yeah. used heaps of stuff. So, All right. I used my mouth once. <laughs> <laughs> Just hang <laughs> there. Duck for a rip. On that odd note, that's good. We'll leave you. Interesting result. Yeah. Decanting. Cheers. Fail on the blending. Yeah, blending. massive fail.